I often talk about fintech, the blockchain technology, decentralized finance on this channel. And over the last 12 months, I made a bunch of videos talking about the best courses and certifications in this area, because one of the goals of this channel, of course, is helping people get in this space, get the right skills, get the right knowledge, and translate these into high paying jobs. So whether you're a graduate studying finance or maybe some unrelated field and you're getting excited about fintech, or if you're a manager at a company that's fast adopting these technologies and you really have to get up to speed and be credible, these courses are for you. And of course, I kept track of all the analytics behind which courses are the most successful, which courses are receiving the best feedback, which courses are less good. And equally, I keep track of the institutions that are designing these courses and how these courses are changing and evolving. And these are some extremely reputable institutions like Yale, Wharton, INSEAD. So today I will give you the very best of, the very best of the courses in the blockchain technology, decentralized finance and fintech. Before we jump into details on the courses, I want to maybe suggest three criteria for you to select the right course for you. Number one, you want a course that fits the requirements that you have. And that's very personal and depends on your situation. You know, whether you're a graduate looking for that first experience and you just want something generic, or you're a coder and you need, you know, that deep dive, deep knowledge and understand how to build this technology. Or you're a manager at a company and you just want to understand the core issues to lead the transformation in your company. This is very, very personal. Number two, you want a course that is designed by a reputable institution. And a lot of these courses are, you just want to pay attention to what you're actually putting on your resume. That shareable certificate is always available. And if you're going to be putting it on your resume, on your LinkedIn profile, you want to have something that is immediately recognizable. And finally, the third criteria, you want to have a course that is not going to take forever. You want something that is going to take you a few days, a few weeks, not something that's going to take you two years. Um, you know, you don't want to waste your time here. Finally, all the courses that I'm going to talk about, the links are below the video so you can review them at your own pace. The first course on the list is the Decentralized Finance course by the Duke University. And talking about a heavyweight name behind a course, Duke is an immediately recognizable name anywhere. Now, this course gives you a very deep understanding of the whole infrastructure behind Decentralized Finance, some of the problems that it solves. It's split in four different sections. The first course is the DeFi infrastructure. We kind of talk about the historical evolution of decentralized finance and really addressing some of the problems that DeFi is now able to solve. Uh, the second is DeFi primitives, uh, where you learn a lot of the technical stuff that you're going to need to kind of understand this space. You learn about loans and swaps, the mechanics of the supply and ownership. And you kind of need those two courses to move on to the third course, which really goes very deep. Uh, this is a decentralized finance deep dive. Um, it gives you a lot of detailed examples of how the mechanics work. Um, for example, they show you how to use a DYDX uh, flash swap to execute an arbitrage transaction. So taking advantage of uh, different prices on two different exchanges for the same asset. And finally, the last uh, sub course here is the decentralized finance risks and opportunities. So look, this course is uh, like all of these are online shareable certificate takes about 30 to 50 hours to take, but it's taught by an engaging professor of decentralized finance at the Duke University. So you see how, how far we've evolved now. We have uh, professors dedicated to this space and this is an amazing course to take. The second course is the blockchain specialization at the University of Buffalo. And this is a great complement to the first course I talked about on decentralized finance, because here you really learn how the blockchain technology drives the shift in decentralized application programming. Now, this one's also split in kind of four subsections, four different courses here. The first one is the blockchain basics, where you really get a broad overview of all the essential concepts of the blockchain technology. You initially explore the Bitcoin protocol, then you move on to the Ethereum protocol. You learn how to create nodes on your personal Ethereum blockchain, create accounts, unlock accounts, mine, transact, transfer ethers, and check balances. So it really gives you a great foundation to start. Now, the second subsection is all about smart contracts. So you learn to design, code, deploy and execute a smart contract. The third section is decentralized applications. So you learn to design and develop end to end decentralized applications. And finally, the fourth section here really puts everything together. The blockchain platform sub course uh, really shows you how the broader blockchain ecosystem functions together. Uh, you learn about all the various different blockchain platforms. Uh, you talk about the Hyperledger, you talk about the Microsoft's Azure's blockchain as a service model, really goes into a lot of detail, but gives you a solid, solid foundation taught by a very engaging professor. Again, takes about 40 uh, to 50 hours to complete everything online, shareable certificate like the previous one. So the first two courses, really, if you're interested in decentralized finance in the blockchain tech are amazing courses to take together. 
The next course I want to talk about is very simply called Financial Markets, and it's taught by Robert Schiller at Yale. Now, very few courses are this well designed and this successful. This is one of the most successful courses on the Coursera platform. I talk about it anywhere I go. Um, very few of us have a chance to study at Yale or have Yale on our resume. And here you have an amazingly designed course taught by Robert Schiller, an absolute legend in the world of economics. Uh, you put it on your resume, and you have that Yale brand there. Uh, this is an absolute no-brainer in terms of credibility. Now, even if you are only interested in the fintech industry or the blockchain technology or decentralized finance, you kind of owe it to yourself to have a really solid base in finance, in the financial markets. And this is exactly what this course is going to do for you. It's split in a bunch of different modules and you kind of talk about the kind of the obvious stuff, stocks, bonds, debt, the capital asset pricing model, inflation. But you talk also about cool things like behavioral finance, uh, uh, market recessions, bubbles, uh, the mortgage crisis, regulation. You learn about the whole environment that is kind of making up the financial world, the traditional financial world that you are trying to change because you're taking all the other courses on the new technology. So you learn about the brokers, the dealers, the exchanges, all the underwriting, the investment banking world. So really gives you a very, very solid foundation, it gives you that Yell recognized name on your resume that is a complete no brainer and it's taught by Robert Schiller. So what else do you want? The next two courses I want to talk about are both designed by INSEAD and taught by the same professors. They're just slightly different, but in terms of name recognition, again, INSEAD is one of the leading business schools in the world. So it's a huge boost to the credibility of your education if you put this on your resume, on your LinkedIn profile. Now, this first course uh, from INSEAD is called the Blockchain Revolution Specialization, and it really teaches you how blockchain is disrupting business models and traditional financial services. It's taught by two professors that are really globally recognized authorities on innovation and technology. They wrote the bestseller called Blockchain Revolution. So here, you really discuss the real world applications of the blockchain technology. The first one here that, that I'm talking about is slightly more generic than the second that's coming up after this one. But again, it's split in four different subsections. You have uh, the introduction to blockchain technologies, transacting on the blockchain, blockchain and business applications and implications and finally blockchain opportunity analysis again very quick course to take about 50 to 60 hours all online shareable certificate but again the credibility behind this course is huge this next course is also designed by INSEAD and taught by the same two professors that the course that i just mentioned uh, but it takes a slightly different angle here it's called a blockchain revolution in financial services specialization and really takes a different angle it takes the angle of specifically how the blockchain technology is transforming the financial services. So if you work in finance, if you work for a wealth manager, an asset manager, or just generally speaking in, in the financial domain, this course is really designed for you because it really discusses and covers uh, the conflicts of how traditional finance and this new tech kind of compete and collide, but also uh, integrate and ultimately cooperate in the long run because they are kind of merging in, the, in how we transform finance, right? Uh, it's also a split in four different sections. The first one is the introduction to blockchain for financial services. The second is the blockchain, crypto assets and decentralized finance. So here we go again. Decentralized finance was the very first course I talked about uh, in this video. Uh, the third sub course is the blockchain transformations of financial services. And finally, the blockchain in financial services where you build your own strategic action plan. So this is a very hands on course designed, like I said, by two professors that are real world class authorities on the subject, have the best seller on the market and really understand the topic. Now, for this next course, I want to switch gears slightly. And it's this course is called the FinTech Foundations and Applications of Financial Technology Specialization. And that's a mouthful of a course name, but uh, it's designed and taught at Wharton. And so Again, we talk about the credibility of the courses and kind of the name recognition, Wharton, an immediately recognizable name, an extremely well-designed course. And I'm saying I'm switching gears a little bit because up to now, I kind of mostly highlighted courses around the blockchain technology, decentralized finance. And these are extremely popular and, you know, highly in demand courses. But here you have a course around the fintech industry kind of in general, not just a very specialized on the blockchain technology, but kind of gives you a really great overview of the whole fintech transformation of traditional finance. It's one of the courses that is most in demand. I see a lot of people taking this course. And so that's why, that's why I'm kind of putting it here on the list. Now it's also split in four different uh, sub courses. Uh, the first one is the fintech foundations, payments and regulations, then cryptocurrency and blockchain and introduction to digital currencies. And the third sub course is the lending, crowdfunding and modern investing. And finally application of AI, insure tech and real estate technology. 
So you see, it kind of goes in all sorts of different directions. Again, like I talked in the beginning of this video, you want to pick a course that really fits the requirements that you have. And if you want to understand what's happening around the fintech industry and how that's transforming traditional finance and how that maybe applies to your company, or you wanted that generic understanding of this space, uh, this is a great course for you. Like I said, one of the most popular courses that I see people take. Finally, the last set of courses I want to talk about are on the Blockchain Council platform, which is an amazing platform also when it comes to anything that's around the blockchain technology and really cryptocurrencies and the whole tech around it, around this space. And there's a lot of really great courses. I've seen, I've seen three or four courses kind of emerge as the leaders of what people usually typically take on this platform. But again, you can kind of explore it at your own space. So when you kind of look at this drop down menu, you see, you know, certified blockchain expert, certified blockchain developer. If you look at the blockchain specialization, you see a lot of different blockchain specialization courses. Uh, anything around Ethereum, uh, certified uh, DeFi expert, certified NFT expert, anything around the cryptocurrency space, certified Bitcoin expert and all these courses. And then you have a section on newly launched courses. So now you see certified metaverse expert, for example. So you have a lot of really great um, kind of deep dive courses, depending on, like I said, the requirements you have, the specialization you're looking for. But again, Blockchain Council, a very well recognized platform as well that has extremely well designed courses. Again. I'm going to leave all the links below the video so you can have explore at your own pace and, and really find the right course for the requirements that you have for, the, for your specific situation and for the needs that you have. So much for the very best off when it comes to courses around fintech, the blockchain technology, decentralized finance. Like I said in the beginning of this video, I talk a lot about this space and I post a lot uh, about these courses and kind of keep track of the feedback and which courses are really the most popular. And so this is really the cream of the cream. You have some extremely reputable institutions. You know, you put this on your resume, on your LinkedIn profile. Very often it opens up doors to new positions. And you know that this is a new area of finance uh, where there is a, a lack of skilled and knowledgeable people. And really, again, it opens up a lot of opportunities for a lot of people. So hope it does the same for you. Thanks for hanging out today. Give a like to the video. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet. And I'll see you next week.